Almost everything that we have recorded, virtually every note in five CDs, has never been recorded ever before. So almost every piece in five volumes of music is a world premiere recording. And most of that music has not been performed at all since the 16th century. The CDs will, I think, open people's ears to repertoire that they, they don't suspect is there. You know, we know English, people know English Renaissance music, but when they say that, they think of later Talis and they think of Bird, fantastic com composers. But this is a generation and more earlier. And uh, this is music when England is still Catholic and still medieval. There are these very long, 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 expansive melismas. Word setting is not so important in the way that it became with the Reformation. Then it becomes polemically very critical that every word be heard. And they had a specific idea about how they meant that. You can understand every word in this stuff too, but it's, it's, it operates differently. So I think it's ear opening to hear um, new music of any kind. I mean, we're doing new music, it just happens to have been written 500 years ago.